Chapter 8, Search and Rescue. What's going on everyone, MetalBlade427 here, and I welcome you back to another episode of Dead Space. In the last episode, we sent an asteroid hurling into space that had a distress beacon on it. Hopefully somebody out there is hearing uh, what's going on in here and has decided to come help us, but unfortunately we have an antenna array here in the bridge that currently can't be picking up any signals for some reason or another. And of course, we are the only ones that can do something about it. Alright, I'm going to step off here, and I'm going to prepare for somebody to call me, because that seems to be... They can't call me when I'm standing in here all ready to go. they got to be as soon as I step out, so... Anybody? Hello? Ah, I knew it! Things are looking up. A military ship just docked in. The USM Valor. Oh, good. I don't know what it was doing out there. It must have gotten our distress signal. I don't care, as long as they got it. We can't talk to it until the comms array is fixed. I'm going to hack the door to communications for you. Thank you. Get in there and find the comms control station. Alright, isn't that awesome? Finally, a little bit of good news around us. We have somebody... Is there anything up there? Last time there was in one of the other ones. No, I don't see anything glowing. Uh, somebody picked up on the distress signal! Yay! So that means they're gonna come and rescue us! Yay! Right? It's good. It's good. Nothing could go wrong. Nothing could stop us. Um, what do I want to do? I actually am going to stop over in the store really quickly. What do I have? I don't have much. Don't have much at all. Um... The uh, pulse rifle is going away, and then I think I'm going to bring back out the Metal Blade Cutter. Uh, mainly because it's like, I don't know, I'm still trying to get a nice, good inventory use uh, right now in terms of what, like, the best weapons for me should be. Let's move all them. Let's take my uh, Ripper and move that over. Very good. I don't think I have anything else. No, just force energy, pulse, line. Do I have any other line? Three lines. Uh, you're coming with me. Uh, so, are... Uh, I have two med packs, do I want to bring another one? Sure. And then, just might as well use my items. Um, I am a little stingy sometimes, trying to hold off on credits in order to uh, save up to buy nodes, which I should probably find myself a bench at some time soon. But for right now, I might as well buy a little bit of plasma energy just so I have it. Good, got my ripper, sounds good. Excellent, wonderful. Yeah, it's about the best thing we're going to have right now. Uh, in terms of game length, we're about halfway through. Uh, we're actually more than halfway through. The Leviathan was about the halfway point. Uh, and then, so we have a few other chapters to go through. Chapter 8 of 12, I think we're on. 12, 12 or 13. Alright, let's head out in here. Because you know shit's going to go down. So let's start grabbing as many items from the side as we possibly can. So, full heal. I love it. I'll take that. And of course, oh, oh, exploders! Exploders coming in from all angles. Hi, buddy. How you doing, sir? Um, thank you. That that made me. Ha oh, reload, reload, reload. Oh shit! Um, I ow. That was no fair. The amount of fairness. Oh crap, crap. Oh, over the corner. Yeah, that was a bad thing. Oh shit! Look at my health. Run away. Running. Run. Run faster, Isaac. Run faster, heal. Run faster! No, no! There we are, that's what I like to see. Pick up stuff, and we have super slashers. Go away! And I know that there's more. There has to be. Oh, you're alive still! Go away! Oh, shit, shit! Heal! And, uh, running? Good thing I grabbed those extra things. Uh, no! Oh my god, we got slashers here. They are just. Being thrown at me in all ways, shape, and form. Get the freaking A! Oh god! Heal! 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 Alright, that's it. You want some? Bring it! Eat my Ripper Blade, you jerk! Me too! Ah! Oh crap, they had enough, and I don't have any more blades. Uh, line gun? Sure! Good? Anybody else? Yeah, there you are. Come here, you son of a bitch. Eat my boot! Ah. Are we done? Holy shit! <laughs> so, as you can tell, the game is not pulling out any punches anymore. Most enemies that you're going to be coming across are going to be extremely deadly. Like, if you thought that the slashers in the beginning of the game were uh, annoying, no, my friends, at this point in the game, they uh, <laughs> there is little to no mercy for Isaac going through. Alright, let's fill that. There we go. What what do I have? Uh, you know what? Let's just use this because I can. It's fine. 
reload this, and I don't have any more cutter ammo, but I will get it as I run around. So for right now, I guess we just gotta take with what we get and move along. We need to head up to the comms array and figure out why that we can't receive that one signal, so... Uh... Up. Oh boy. Oh jeez. Um... Isaac, the door to communications is open. Oh good! But I've been getting some weird feedback spikes on the local comms. What do you mean? I think someone's listening in on us, so be careful. Oh, great. So we have a hacker of some sort, somebody on the other end trying to hear our conversations? I don't like that. That's an invasion of my privacy. Anything else here? Uh, ooh, smash! Oh, come on, Isaac. There we are. I will take the plasma rounds, and uh, of course we have pulse rounds here. After I already put the pulse gun, uh, the pulse rifle back. They probably had already spawned the moment that I uh, started up this chapter, so it thinks I still have the pulse rifle. But I do not. It's a guardian. Oh, God. Come on, go away. It's a, it's a, it's a, ow. Spin. Shoot. Shoot all of the thingies. Shoot all of the thingies. Ugh. Come on. I can be very precise on my shots. There we go. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, would you drop? Would you drop? Yes, some health. Yoink. And now we have these things on the side of the walls that have opened up. Very good, very good, very good. And we move on to see another freaking wall guardian. Come on. Ow. Die. Oh shit, I'm running out of ammo. I'm running out of ammo again. Please. The, uh, there we go. We killed it. I killed it. Now we got these things shooting at me. Are we done? Come on, there we go. Eat that, you little fuck bucket. Anything else? Good. And I don't have any more ammunition, but oh my god, I got two large med packs? Man, I mean, thank you, Wall Guardians, for giving me these things, but holy crap, okay, that's fine. But we're gonna put on the line gun. This is gonna be a uh, primary weapon for a little while, which is fine by me. It's strong, it's powerful. Oh, I think I know what's coming up. Oh. Okay, so. Remember all of those little divider things that I fought? It looked like like an octopus head and like claws and everything. Well, this is what it looks like when it's all together. This is the adult divider. I'm going to stasis it and then I'm going to shoot it. Actually, I'm going to. Oh, blaster! There you go. Explode. Fall apart. Yeah, see, now it's all different uh, pieces, which really sucks. Oh, man. Come on. Get, get, get in. But you dropped the ruby something, conductor. Ow, bastard. I want that. Give me. Do I have any ammunition in this at all? I have nine shots. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Dude. Nope. Ah! Freaking face hugger. Little bastard. There we go. Okay. So, yeah. So, that is a full grown adult divider. And once you kill it, it does drop an item because it is, you know, still an enemy. And then it breaks apart into all of those little uh, pieces. Sweet. I got a little Ripper Blade. That would have been the best thing to use against it because you would have been able to fire off a Ripper Blade and, of course, you know, chop at the bits. And then when it divides, you still have your Ripper Blade out and you're able to take damage further. So. The Ripper is probably the best thing to use against it. It is very powerful, so just don't take it lightly. If it gets too close to you, it will use uh, its claws and its powerful swipes in order to try to take off your head, which is something that we should all be used to by now in this game, because everything wants to take off Isaac's freaking head. Uh, what do I got in terms... I have six nodes. You know what I am going to do? I am going to use this bench really quickly, and I'm going to go ahead and I should... Uh, there's so many things that I should actually build up. Um, the stasis module may be it. I'd rather build up this thing completely first, and then go ahead and fill up everything else. So, um... Yeah. I'm gonna do that. I'm not gonna have enough to do it to fill it up completely. Okay, I'm gonna hold off for right there. I'm gonna need two more nodes. I always carry around one node. You never can tell. But at least then I'll be able to power up duration and energy, and then I'll have a full stasis module, which is great. The next thing I would probably do is go to my plasma cutter, and then start building up the reload, and then both capacities and the speed to fill that up, and then the line gun would be the next thing that I would power up. So there you go. That is the order to which I plan on building up my weapons. 
until then, let's just keep moving right along. Um, yeah, line gun. I'd rather have the range just in case. I have more than five shots, right? I think so. What does my inventory look like? Oh yeah, definitely more than five shots. Sweet. With a Ruby Semiconductor that I can uh, sell. Audio log. Communications log. First comms operator Bailey reporting. I think the you're ship new. Is under attack, but request to issue a distress call have been repeatedly denied Help. by Captain Matthias. He won't say it, mm. but everyone on the bridge knows why. This is an illegal operation in a prohibited system. Oh, jeez. We've all known for months, and we kept our mouths shut. Not anymore. So what Mayday, they've been doing Mayday, here has been illegal. Mayday, this is USG Ishimura. This is... What the hell? What? What's going on? Bailey? I don't believe this. The whole comm system is offline. Oh, wow. Now he's gone too far. Bailey out. Oh, man, that sucks. So, yeah, this entire planet cracking thing that we've been doing is has been nothing more than one big rouge this entire time. They aren't here looking for minerals or anything along that way. They are here looking for other stuff. Alien artifacts, a.k.a. the marker. And so what we're going to be doing now is we are going to be riding this cool little tram thing way down this way. Whee! Hands in the air. Ah! So this is going to send us all the way to the other end where the uh, comm station is. Hey, look, there's somebody. Hi, buddy. Ooh. Ow. Bye. You all right? You all right, dude? Good? Oh, all right. Ooh. We'll hang it out there for a moment. Go, 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 go. All right. That was a fun little trip. Made our way all the way to the other end of the ship. And this is apparently where the comm tower is now. Array offline. Yeah, I know they Your are. Service technician has been notified. That's me. That comm array is in bad shape. We need at least six working dishes for a strong enough signal. Make sure they're aligned symmetrically so there are no power gaps. Basically, this is a little puzzle that we have to uh, complete right now. Oh, we get another schematic. What are you? You are... Uh, medium air can. Okay, that's cool. So we're getting pretty close to having like all of like the big big stuff available in the shops as well. I have enough stasis. So basically, um, let's head down into the area first and then I will explain exactly what we have to do with this puzzle. Of course, along the way, I'm going to be collecting as much stuff as I can. What was that? Was that a gold one? Yeah, nice. They gave me a gold semiconductor. Awesome. And a second node. They're just throwing nodes at me now. That is more than happy. I am very excited for that. Can't hear me complaining about free nodes. That's 10,000 uh, credits that I don't have to spend. And then I can actually probably use the buy ammunition that I'm so low on. All right, enter here into a zero gravity area. Entering zero gravity. All right, so basically hear how it works. You look up there and we see a leaper way against the side. Um, huh. oh crap, you bastard. Oh, he flying to the whatever body parts are in front of me. Thank you, running, running, running. I know that attracted somebody else. So I'm gonna reload. There you are, you little bastard. Come here, come on, come on. I know you're right there. I don't know how many there are. I want to say there's only two, but you never can tell. Come on, come on. And... Go to rip it! Why am I not ripping things? There we are. Oh. Come on. Oh, there is two. Okay, they're a little bit too close to my comfort. Go away. Ah. Ah. All right, I killed you. The one more. Hello? Hi, buddy. How you doing? You feel- Ow! You know what? I was trying to help you. If you're gonna be like that, then screw yourself. What'd you drop? Stasis pack. You're worthless. Um, I saw- a Oh, there it is. Oh, there's two! Sweet. Boom. Give me your credits. And... Come on, box. Let's go. Smish! Give me your contact energy, aka credits. Anyway, any other boxes here? Anything else I can smash? No, we're good. Okay, now, puzzle time. Right on the side, as you can see, that is the comms array. What we need to do is we need to make a complete circle. So we have uh, two right there, one down on the bottom, and then anything that's green is an active uh, tra uh, transmitter. Anything that's red is inactive, and anything that is clear is an open kind of uh, spot. So as we run around, we can go ahead and use our kinesis to remove one of the broken uh, the, the satellite uh, antennas, throw it, 
and then use our kinesis to pick up a working one and put it into, come on, let's go, and put it into a hole, like so. See? So now then if you look up top, haha, we have two and two. We need to create a full circuit, as she said, so it has to be in a big circle, so that's why I usually, you can use any one of these. You can do the furthest one outside, inside, or the first set in the middle. I like sticking with the middle because it's pretty much already halfway done for you. Now we need to oop, jump over here. Uh, let's get rid of you. Goodbye. And I need to find uh, another working one, which I believe that's this. Hey, come on. Oh, are you serious? I can't hit it? What about uh, up here? No. There's even some working ones just floating around in the middle of nowhere. So if you keep your eye out above you, you should be able to find something. Come on, Isaac. There we go. Uh, da, 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 da. Where are they? Oh, wait. There we go. Come here. Pick it up. There we are. Come to me. And into the hole. Click. Now we jump over here in order to fix the last one. Up. Go away. And our final working antenna is in the back. And this will solve the puzzle. It's really easy. It's not like anything too crazy. See? Everything realigned. Perfect. That's it. Yay. It's working. Get back to communications and use the control panel to send our coordinates to the Valor. Yep which is the people that apparently picked up on our signal and then we can go ahead and let them know that we are alive and that they should come and save us because it sucks in here a lot i mean look at these things uh, the high no no i don't want you i want you to go far away from me a little bastard do i have anything else okay good yay i did have some plasma energy probably heal as well right now not yet I'm gonna wait till I get myself to a uh, to um, a store in order to do that so back and around here we can come up to the panel and hey hello anybody read us we need help this is Ooh, USM it's Iron Man wide casting on all frequencies to USGE Shimura in response to your SOS. Tony, we need help. You picked up your escape pod number 47. We need a Hulk. Route to your position. This message will repeat every 30 seconds until you respond. I'm responding. Hello. What? Isn't that the escape pod Hammond jettisoned? One of those things was on board. Ah, oh, crap. They opened up the pod? No. No, this isn't going to happen. Oh, shit. USM Valor. Come in, Valor. Our signal isn't strong enough. Of course it's I not. Why would it be? To boost the signal. Error. Blast door blockage detected. Are you serious? Contact a repair technician. That's Shit. me. Isaac, there's something big on the hull of the ship, directly Ugh. above the comms array. Something organic. I don't know what it is, and I don't care. We well, I do. The door is open to transmit to the Valor. You should have a clear shot from ADS Cannon 48. Get to the cannon and blow it out into space. Yay, we get to go ahead and fire off more cannons. Isn't that exciting? But we're going to go ahead and do that in the next episode. Thank you all for watching. Be sure to like and comment down below. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button so you can get equipped with me, Metal Blade 427 In the next episode, we need to head over to another cannon area in order to clear off whatever the hell it is that's blocking our transmissions out from the Ishimura. It is big. It is ugly. It is considered a boss. And it is going to be a good time. You guys have a good one. And I will catch you all later. Let's, uh, let's get its attention. Hey! Oh boy. Okay, here we go. Start shooting. Start shooting. Start getting some uh, firing on, on this thing already. Oh crap. See, it's already starting to pick up crap from the ground. And it's shooting tankers at me and picking up pieces of the ship. And oh my god, I'm taking a lot more damage than I want to take. Come on, shoot it, shoot it, shoot it. Oh god. No, 